Welcome back to the channel. It is I, Jack. Today I want to talk about my extended absence from the YouTubes, the why, and where we go from here, and why does my hair look stupid. <laughs> so let's get into it. Well, really simple. You know, YouTube is just kind of a hobby. I do it when I can. Uh, I used to make a fun outlet for complaining about you know, retarded nonsense, uh, you know, woke people, uh, stupid movies or shows or crap celebrities or, uh, you know, all that kind of stuff or cyclists. I love, I love ragging on cyclists because cyclists, you know, you, by and large cyclists are a bunch of douchebags. Let's just be real. Anyway, speaking of that, Tour a day Tucson is tomorrow. That's going to be fantastic. Yep, lots of points to go around, right? Oh, there's one. Bup, 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 bup. I'm joking. I'm joking. I would never do such a thing. At least I don't think so. Anyway, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, that's right. Um, so you know, I've I've been quite busy with you know life things. Uh, I had to get a house on the market. Took a little bit of work. It's not going very well. <laughs> it is on the market. It is not selling. Not my fault. That's that's inflation for you. That's that's what happens when you have super duper inflation. Nobody wants the interest rates that go along with buying a house. In fact, two or three years ago, it took a seventy thousand dollar income or so to buy a, a decent house. Now it's one hundred and seventeen. Thousand, I think, is the number. Yeah. So people don't have money, and interest rates are high. Really sucks. Sucks all around. Um. Along with that, I have had a ill grandfather who spent about eight weeks in the hospital and rehab combined. Uh, went in for some anemia, had a mask that they had to remove, cinched him right up, no poopy bag or nothing like that, he's he's a champ, the dude is like a tank, indestructible, had a clot that he had to take out because, you know, no blood thinners equals clot if you're prone to that, which unfortunately he is, um, for such an ancient man, no, he's only 94, only 94 guys. This man is a uh, inspiration to all, should be. He can go through two surgeries like that back to back and he can walk. <laughs> With a walker now, unfortunately, but he's he's, he's hanging in there. Uh, I'm, I could not be more inspired by that man. I love him to death. But taking care of family members, putting a house on the market and working um, these are higher priorities to me. Now, like I said, I don't make money off of YouTube. I don't have any, you know, I mean, I, I, I don't have very many subs, subscribers. I don't really care much about subscriber count. Not one of those. People watch my videos, cool. If they like them, sweet. If not, at least I had an outlet, right? So, I kind of go through the other thing. Uh, as much fun as it is to make make fun of things, um, rag on woke people, the cyclists, the all the other crap that makes me mad, or you know that I could turn into comedy in my mind. Still negative stuff, right? It's still negative. It's still not positive and I'm kind of tired of doing negative things I'm tired of producing negative content because I'm an optimist and I don't want to live life negatively so having said that you know if, if, if and one might have noticed the last several videos uh, between doing 
commentary similar to what like Casey Butch would do you know talking about an issue or something seriously without you know taking pot shots at any people or anything like that I like doing that I also like uh, you know I I did the uh, parody the Chris Fix parody video you know uh, with the ladies car that was pretty funny for me it was funny I don't really care for anybody else I just think the guy's voice is funny and he works with his hands and all you see is hey guys I got gloves on and I'm about to work on something so let's get going you know that guy's awesome he's he, he really is awesome love his channel but his voice is funny and the hands thing is funny so I was trying to do something ridiculous with that. So I, I thought it was it was fun for me to do. And I needed to do actual car work anyway. And I needed to get back into wrenching anyway. So I was like, hey, this is a great opportunity to do all that. You know, after I did, you know, a little, little uh, I, I had to make it somewhat ridiculous. You know, people do these little video things or car, but I don't like, I don't like rap music. And I'm an 80s kid, so I'm like, yeah, well, how, how else am I going to do this? So, yeah, that's right, like, synthwave or 80s pop, you know? <laughs> I mean, I, I just wanted to be, I just want to be more uh, uh, positive moving forward. Have, you know, better things to offer and say than just, you know, this person sucks, that person sucks, this all sucks. Let's make fun of it, and I, I, I mean, I might do that from time to time, but I'm kind of, I'm, I'm really, really tired of doing it. It's not, it, it's, it doesn't really offer anything that um, is lasting or helps change things or doesn't make anybody better. So, I'm gonna go away from that a little bit, huh? Anyway, I got some ideas for things to do, and I, but I've just been very tied up. So I still live. I'm not dead. I haven't, uh, you know, I haven't, uh, you know, had to uh, walk the gallows as a pirate or, you know, um, or anything like that. I'm, I'm good. I'm not sick. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe just in here, right? Okay. Well, anyway, that's all I have to say. And normally, you know, there'd be some sort of like cool background music, you know, some, you know, elevator music. There's no elevator music today. No cheeseburgers falling with fart sounds. That is pretty fun, though. I do like that stuff. But um, we will talk to you again real soon.